Hello there, this is Malik and welcome to episode 59 of my Space Haven series. We've just had a successful little thing on a thing. Yep, that's that's the wording I'm going to stick with. Um, and uh, we're just going to salvage it up now. I don't know how the mining's done. I think the mining is basically done at this point. Yeah, there's nothing of anything left. Good. Good stuff. We've got our little thing doing its things. I need to work on my vocabulary. That's what I need to do. Um, so yeah, it will just be uh, speed things up a bit so that we can loot all of this stuff and get out of here, I guess. So far we've got a net lo Oh no, there we go. So the energy has is, is suddenly a appeared. I think that might have been some stuff that's been mined and, and you know, extracted and whatever. This This thing. Oh, well, maybe not. I don't know. We've still got five raw energy in, which, as far as I'm concerned, is a good amount. And we've got energy in here as well. So actually, I think that's probably where it's coming from. The salvage from this ship is is going to help power our ship. Sounds good. Speed it up even more. See so how much more I've got pulsating wall. We don't like the pulsating wall. Okay, well, yeah, we're just, we're just stripping everything down now. I mean, it's all useful. That's the thing. It's all useful stuff, and it all might have salvage. Yeah, people are, are chilling, having fun. There's there's meteorites hitting the ship shields. It's fine, but look at that. Look at that massive backlog of goods. I mean, we literally have space. I kind of feel like logistics needs to take a higher priority, guys. I don't think it's taking the high priority that it deserves. Oh, thanks, Walter. I mean, every little helps, I guess. No, no, you are actually just moving things around. That's cool, that's cool. Still needs more, but we'll 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 allow it for now. What actually is going on with this derelict anyway? We don't have anything more to transfer. The salvage is irrelevant, so basically it's useless. The salvage is complete. Oh, and, and actually in the meantime they someone had transferred all the stuff. That's good. I guess the moment everything's done as far as salvage goes, everyone just comes back to the ship and starts unloading. We kind of need another... another airlock. That would be useful. That would be useful. I kind of need a... Hmm. I've got an idea for a ship. It's going to take a lot of hull blocks. And whilst we do have 20 hull blocks, and more to come, I suspect, because, you know, not much hull scrap, actually. Um... Yeah, I kind of like one want, want a docking collar in the middle, kind of like bulgy at the back and bulgy at the front almost, but then like slightly thinner in the middle. I don't know. I don't know. We'll we'll see how it goes, I guess. The ship will will slowly evolve, but I have to kind of think about how I want to do that earlier rather than later, I suppose, before everything gets set in stone. But that the idea would be is you'd have two airlocks kind of opposite each other. With an area in the middle purely for unloading cargo. Um, and it would still have things like the pods and the fighters and, and, and all of that shenanigans. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Food. I've not been looking at food. We are running a bit low on food. We are... We're okay. But obviously we need more of the good stuff. This sector is useless. It is no good to us anymore. Um, I guess just more salvage. There's an outpost over there. We can go to the outpost. We can do a bit of mining. Hope that there's some trade running around. In fact, actually, let's um, let's prep for jump. Jumps are pretty cheap right now, in the sense that we've got a lot of, um... 
raw materials. We can mine away all of these things. My goodness, look how it's a, like a tiny, tiny little outpost. It's practically not worth even looking at. Oh, rogue bots. Well, so rogue bots are incoming, but we needed a scanner to find their exact arrival. This place is good, though. This place is nice. This this is this is hopefully gonna help defend us. Okay, so Kronos Station. Oh, okay. Well, we'll um, we'll talk. They might want some random scrap and give us lots of money. What do they want? Steel plates. Eee, my goodness, steel plates are a uh, uh, are quite the commodity, dude. I wish I could check my inventory. <laughs> Seriously, that's not. Yeah, that's that's a big shame. It's a lot of money, but it's a. Fuck it. And um, we have four steel plates. Okay. Well, let's talk to them. Um, do a bit of trade. What we need is a new trade. I wonder if the steel plates will appear in their inventory. <laughs> Buy them back. Maybe for less. Um, we got a lot of money for the steel plates, to be fair. That was good. That was good. And we only really need them for certain types of construction and, and, and hull reinforcement. So I'm not too concerned. Uh, what do we have plentiful amounts of? That's a... A relative term. We've just used a lot of soft blocks, so I think some soft blocks we can afford to spare. Um, some raw chemicals. Weren't we? Were we processing chemicals yet? Maybe not. We've got some veggies and some nuts. I think the veggies and the nuts can go a little way as well. Let's give you loads. In fact, actually, stuff the veggies and the nuts. We'll keep a few more and give you just more. More of that. Um, and now we will swipe some of that. Some of that tasty energium. I don't even really need the energium at this point. And that's, um, you know, a bit of a brave, brave statement. Is there anything actually I do need? That's the question. You know, I was mentioning before meat. Artificial meat, um, some fruits, both of those are things that we do need. So actually, that's a good, that's a good deal. So what I'm going to do, because the rogue bots are coming, I want people on um, operations, oh, no, operations, like, all the time if possible, please. Oh, there we go. So, maximum urgency. People on shields and operations. So, let's have a little look. Where are these rogue... No, that's the wrong button. This is the correct button. There they are. The little buggers. Um. Okay, so we've got the scouty one. In fact, actually, why don't I turn around and scramble fighters? Like, literally, I can scramble fighters. Here they come. They're going to approach this station first, which theoretically will shoot at them. That's a lot of bots. They are actually opening fire on the station first. But we are also now opening fire, and they're opening fire on us as well. Our shields are taking a hammering, but we've got a lot of point defense, so we're devastating them. Shields have started to recover a little bit. Okay, that's going to probably communicate back. Oh, God. More. More rogue bots. Okay, so, um... How do I target these buggers? Remove target. Attack, target, set rally points.
There we go. So... That will just rally around that location. It won't shoot us. Move target. Okay, so we've got incoming dudes. We're going to keep people out in the fighters. Um, because they just take a while to, uh, to do their thing. And I think it would be useful just to have them out ready so we can pursue the one that... that uh, Swouter and Gillian are just probably going to get a bit tired. Okay, so rogue bots detected. Where are they coming from? They're coming from over there this time. So I'm going to let them circle a bit more. Because I don't want the fighters to immediately... Go out. Um, no. No. Sorry, no. Yeah, you come, come back to the rally point. I don't want you venturing too far from the ship. Okay, there we go, guys. Nice shooting, guys. Nice shooting. That's not a scout, so that's okay. And the little star fighters are going out. Pew, pew, pew! Yeah, these guys... They got wrecked. Okay. Good work, guys. Good work. That's this this is this is good. It is it is fun. The little starfighters thing is fun. I know it's quite an old patch now, I think, isn't it? It's an old an old uh, expansion. Um but uh But yeah. It's still circling, is it because... So if I remove the target... Ah, because the target was still there. So now they, they there's no target. Because the target was like a rally point. You know, focus your attention on this area kind of a tag. So now they're going to come back. And um, well done, Walter and Gillian. Gillian, and you just, you just... You're all doing really well. Thank you. We still have a trade um, pending. But that's fine. Let's have a little look. This is this is fine. Everyone's on their break. Everyone's chilling, enjoying each other's company, having a bit of a nom. Bit of a nom. Nom. It's all good. Shields took a hit. We can recharge those easy enough. Oh, why are they why is there a patrol happening? Fighters shouldn't be doing fightery things. There we go. I think maybe it was a coincidence that they went back when the other one did, because I think I may have only removed a target from one. Perhaps. Perhaps. So good, though. I I legitimately love this, uh, the way it works. It's um, really, really good. Just gotta get used to it. That's what it is. So we've got what, four point defences? Two at the front, two at the back. We've got two shield generators. Um, we've got one... See, it says there we've got one point defence system. Which is obviously not true. But I think the point defence system can, is, like, counted as a single thing. Yeah, because you, you, you get one person in operations. Yeah, because it's a symbol. There. Um, operations symbol. Operations. Fighters. Shields. Duh. Um, yeah. 
It's all good. It's all good. The trade is occurring. Huzzah. Um, we've not been mining. You know, I should probably um, say mine things. <laughs> Oops. Incoming ships. Merchant Federation was more civilians. Another Merchant Federation. Cool. I'm 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 okay with these. I'm all I'm all neutral, stroke friendly terms with them. Now they're gonna get the mining things. The mining claws. Oh, good. So I'll wait for these other ships to come in. Do a bit of trade. Um. And, uh, and, and that's basically it, really. Okie dokie. Energy, we're, we're stable with energy. Obviously, more energy would be good. But we've got some, um, exotic ore. So, we'll, 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 we'll have some. We'll have, have a little bit. Okay, so, Merchant Federation. Let's have a little look at this f first dude. What have they got? They make quite a lot of artificial meat. It's a bit pricey. Wow, we've got... We've got a lot of fruit suddenly. I think we just had a crop. Which I literally could just start selling them some of our of our sort of bounty, as it were, and just a load of, of organic matter. Yeah. Let's trade a bunch of organic matter with these guys. Anything else? I mean, they've got some meat. They've got some energy. Um, anything really cheap that's nice? Because of beers. We could buy a bunch of beers for everyone. Kind of feel like that's a nice little treat, maybe. I don't know. I don't think they'll necessarily appreciate it as much as, you know, it'll cost. <laughs> but, uh, but it would be more than fine. See, nuts are maybe not so valuable, but we are producing... We don't eat as many, from what I remember. I'm going to have to check the dietary settings, whatever you want to call them. I almost want to get even more than that, but we'll see. More organics. There we go. So we've got another two trades, and at that point I will leave for the next sector. Well, they're, they're doing trades. Interesting. I like it. Yeah, they're properly going for it as far as trade goes, aren't they? Lots and lots of cross-trading and stuff. Okay, we have some artificial meat, which we can add to our stocks. Civilians, what do you want, civilians? No more iron, no more steel plates, dudes, because we, we, we kind of need the steel plates for ourselves. Water, yeah, absolutely. Give us water. We'll happily give you water. Two trades. Okay, we've got one trade. I think that the yeah, the one of those trades is just basically giving water for, to someone for a load of money. Yeah, you, you can have some water. I'm pretty sure we've got loads of it. Okay, so we are done with this sector, I think. We've done some trading, blah blah blah, done a load of other things. We can happily uh begin to jump. Yeah, where are we where are we likely to be going? There's a derelict over there. There's some more resources we can mine there. I'm kind of feeling like just getting the resources for now and then doing a derelict. 
Come on, let's get this jump sorted out. Okay. Let's just go to there first. See how other ships are moving around. I don't think there are any hostiles in here. Asteroids again. Nope, oh, wrong button. Mine all of that. Mine all of that. Go for it. Might as well speed it right the way up. Yeah, we're still not great on the amount of energy we've got. Well, while we've actually got the Android Collective here, let's see what their take on energy is. Well, I mean, there's basically nothing there. These guys have some energy in. It's not cheap, but eh, what do they value? Apparently they value hull blocks. I haven't really got too many spare hull blocks, but tech blocks? I don't really want to do that. I could sell some hyperfuel. Hyperfuel's somewhat valuable. Yeah, we've got loads of Hyperium. So, I feel like, I mean, it's not a good price. It really, really isn't. But it's what we've got and it's what they want. Well, it's what we've got. <laughs> Let's leave it at that. There we go. We'll, we'll get some energy in from them, guys. we go. Just need to wait for the mining trip to uh, to finish. Looks like we've just got the one rock left. Oh, people are having a break. I don't blame it. I don't blame people. Nice. Yeah, it's a bit late on that big rock, guys. Okay, so that is that sector done. Boy. Yeah, let's head there. Oh, it's a couple as well. Ooh, okay, let's stop. Oh, rogue bots. Okay, well. Incoming. A scanner, so okay, fair enough. Well, I would say that uh, fighters um, set rally point. I need someone on operations at all times, please. Um, and, and ideally someone on shields. Beyond that, we're basically alright. Looking at these ships, there's no telltale signs of, of robot infestation. Oh, but that, that has some naughty things on board. Okay. Fighters, get in the skies, now! Why aren't people getting in the bloody fighters? I have no, no idea.
I have to put a, like a point here, and that therefore that is now not targeting something that they can't target. Like what is what is the <sighs> typical, isn't it? Right, the someone's on operations, but but people just I don't know why they weren't getting in the sh in the ships. Oh my god, there's loads of them. I really wish people had got in their fighters. Oh, it's too bloody late for the fighters now, I would have thought. But, yeah, rally around the ship, I guess. Jeez. Point defense, guys. Point defense. I don't think the point defense is going to be enough, though. They're going to latch on like little shits. And they then stop being targets, I think. Oh no, they are still targets for the fighters. The fighters can shoot them. Oh boy. Oh, okay. I'm happy with this. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that massively. So... That's a fantastic discovery. So, so the fighters are actually able to shoot off the alien attachy things. Um, whereas the point defense, the moment the aliens latch on, the point defense can't target it. I think these guys are going to have some fun times. To be fair, they're probably not going to have any time at all. They're just going to be like, oh, it's a thing. We're going to destroy it. I doubt very much these guys will have a problem. But here's the question. Oh, you know what? I shouldn't have um, put people away when there's when there's drones on the uh, on the way. Fighters, ideally, please. <clears throat> Shields, we can put low priority now. So sorry, I know you've just been. Thingy in. Oh, that's brown. Yeah, I haven't kind of. Okay. I am actually going to say fighters are top priority. Yeah, sorry, guys. I really, really need to find battle stations. Everyone get in their ships or something. I don't know what is with the fighters. They just are really lethargic getting in the fighters. See, this guy's kind of like idling, forced to work piloting. But they're idling. So I don't know why they don't get in the ships. You know, I've got man the fighters. I've got attack targets. Um... You know, I've got I've got all of the things that are needed, surely. I, I just don't know why they don't do it. I just don't know why they <sighs> Yeah, I, I I don't know. I don't know. Um it says that they are forced to work piloting, but they're not doing it. And I don't know why. Ugh. Yeah, there's no way of me forcing the job. Carrying out repairs. It's like piloting, manning a fighter. So you see, eventually they have manned a fighter. But it's, it's honestly, it's kind of, it's not too little too late, but kind of is. Oh, here we go.
Are they bugger enough? Our fighters are definitely better than those drones. Come on, fighter, shoot it. Nice shooting. Nice uh, shooting, son. What's your name? Murphy. Okay, so there we go. I still do not know how to um, get the fighters to just launch better. Um, but... Eh... What you gonna do, I suppose? What you gonna do? Okay, so that is that is that for this episode. Um, next episode, I'm gonna hopefully board these derelicts and see what they're up to. But until that time, I will bid you all farewell, and of course, cheerio.